Visiting the college your student is interested in is very important. However, it can get expensive. Colleges may be scattered all over the state or country. Here are some options to best budget your money during this time. Start with virtual tours. You and your student can check out everything from the student union to the building of their department in 3D detail. You can find colleges through a virtual tour tool on their site. Virtual tours can be helpful in narrowing down your decision. However, virtual tours can be limited. Use our college ranking tool to select and visit those colleges that rank high. Once you've selected some campuses, here are some practical tips. To cut down on family travel costs, decide who will be traveling and who will not. Lodging and traveling to the college, unless it's within 100 miles or so, usually is the largest expense in college visits. Call the admissions office and ask about fly-in programs. Fly-in programs cover airline costs, hotel discounts, or free meals in the dining hall. Fly-in programs frequently depend on financial need, talent, or academic performance. When traveling as a family, look for travel specials on discount travel sites. Be sure to use an incognito window when searching. Multiple visits might make the prices go up for airlines, car rentals, and hotels. A lodging site may give you options that are not just hotels. Book airline tickets as soon as you know your visit dates. Try to remain flexible with dates and always try your best to avoid peak travel times during June through August. Don't be misled to book flights with budget airlines that may have complicated policies. Make sure that you inform yourself on return or change policies for airline tickets. For example, the ticket might be cheap, but they charge extra for choosing a seat or bringing a carry-on luggage. Try to visit colleges on your students' list that are in the same regions on the same trip to save on airfare. Another option is to book your student on an organized college tour. Organized college tours offer trips for students to visit several schools. They might include various regions of the country and well-organized trips to many colleges. Organizers for these tours will have more knowledge about what questions students should ask various departments than we have as parents. When it comes to car trips, try taking the quickest routes. Attempt to rent the cheapest vehicle that fits your family. Once you've arrived at the campus, try to walk as much as possible. This will help reduce gas and parking costs. Try picking hotels close to the campus, which will help reduce gas costs. Visiting other campuses that are close by might be useful, even if it's not on the top of your list. It can give you and your student ideas of what you like and what you don't. Take public transit instead of driving once you arrive. Campus parking for visitors can be difficult to figure out and adds cost to your expenses. Work in the tour as a family vacation. Consider planning your own vacation around college tours. Communicating and having a plan of action will help you maximize your college visits.